even if they're not all happy and rainbows and unicorns. So it's uh, this song is about like loving someone. If someone is kind of difficult to love, that's when you actually need to love them the most. So uh, and vice versa, you would expect that from your lover too. So this song is called Turbulence. Also, when I wrote this song, uh, it started off as a love song, but I was always into activism, so it kind of goes into a protest song towards the end. <laughs> It's about, it's called Father Stan. So Father Stan was a tribal rights activist. And uh, this, is, this is Michael Ilya. So um, he, he did a lot of work for tribals and uh, he was imprisoned for a long time. He was a very old man and he dedicated his entire life towards helping people from a different community. and. Um, he was, yeah, basically he was imprisoned without a trial. So he was in jail with no trial and like he suffered a lot. So um, yeah, it was a huge human rights issue. 
and um, his dedication and passion and commitment towards doing something really inspired me so i wrote this song and it's kind of like a story about what happened to him and how he inspired me as an artist to continue doing what i should do even though it might seem difficult at times so yeah this is father stan this one's for you father stan They barged into your home without a warrant Looks like they got what they wanted By unlawful action They don't have the attraction everyone out there they want to keep the truth from you they want to keep the truth from you yeah they want to keep the truth from you they want to keep the truth from you clap clap they want to keep the truth from you they want to keep the truth from you they want to keep the truth from you because they think it'll make you less blue Unfortunately, Father Stan passed away in police custody, and I really wanted to take the risk of showing him the song. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? I would go to jail, right? But uh, yeah, it it was it was very inspiring his story to me. So yeah, I'm glad you liked it. Um, okay, my next song is a bit uh, PG. <laughs> it's a, it's a little. Uh, It has some swear words in it but I'm going to just um substitute it with another word uh which is so oh fish okay I was thinking about the rhythm so 
can drop the PG words if you can sing them because the kids have gone home. Oh! Yeah. The kids have gone home? Okay. 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 Uh, kind of stab me in the back so this is this is for all the girls who stab each other in the back don't do it <laughs> just don't just be nice love one another <laughs> okay <laughs> open my heart and show you my world okay i'm going to do that again sorry <laughs> that was a little too high pitch for my liking. Open, open. Okay, cool. Open my heart and show you my wounds. I, I take all the pain and turn them into tunes. Ninety-nine dog balloons when I'm with you. Clueless about myself, but not a fool. Breaking all the rules. Self-esteem dropping so low, be confident. That's the key. Stay out of misery. Go and on and on into infinity. But can't get to her. I'll sing it slowly. Breaking all the rules when I'm in school, bitches be cruel. Yeah, one more time. Breaking all the rules when I'm in school, bitches be cruel. One more time. Breaking all the rules when I'm in school, bitches be cruel. I can't hear you. Have you ever been hurt? Breaking all the rules. Now I'm super high. You guys are so awesome. I love you all. Best, best audience ever. Till now. Okay. Ooh. So the next one is a little more. Inward looking, actually, all of them are. But yes, most of my songs are like diss tracks, you know. Someone's heard me and I'm like, oh, oh. No. <laughs> it, just, it just flows out, you know. So I usually write songs when I'm in a very emotional state. And um, yeah, the next one that I'm gonna sing for you is. Uh, it has a more optimistic outlook. So, <laughs> even though there's so much pain in your life, it's always gonna be fine. Just, just remember that. It's every every moment is passing. It's all momentary. 
So it's all good. Okay, so this one is about letting in the light. It's called Let in the Light. And uh, yeah, till now, whatever I performed, they are all uh, unreleased yet. I mean, I will eventually release them. But yeah, I'm first time performing all of this just with a uke, you know, with fellow ukulele players. So. <laughs> no, that's, why, that's why the vibes are so good here. Hey. All right, so um, let in the light, yeah. a good idea to make a music video here so I shot the music video for the next song that I'm about to perform all around Goa heavy jagad <laughs> but that's what's most fun so yeah the song is called 11 days and I wrote it uh, during the lockdown time um, when I was in a live-in relationship with this dude and uh, <laughs> like I said dude <laughs> Okay, and um, yeah, it, it was, the song is about how technology uh, comes in between intimacy. So it kind of is posing the question about how important technology is, how, how people choose technology over intimate moments, you know. If anything gets awkward, our 
reflex reaction is <laughs> to just take out our phones, right? So the song is kind of about that. And yeah, I teach music, right? So during the lockdown, I was just online classes after online classes, just sitting there and like being so robotic all the time. So this is kind of about like, you know, the movies we watched as kids when they would show how futuristic the world is and AI is going to take over and stuff is kind of actually happening right now, so <laughs> be careful. <laughs> yeah, this one's called 11 Days. And yeah, I'm going to release it very, very soon. So please do check it out. The music video was shot in Goa. Um, Gonna end up sad and alone. <laughs> You've been on the phone for eleven days, talking to your boss, trying to get a raise. I'll be taking class, trying to find a way to get out of this mess, leave without a trace. You'll be trying to figure out all my ways, stitch me like a lazy daisy. Okay, racing through my mind. Bottomizing thoughts cause I'm insane, yeah <laughs> Stillness in still in my veins Witness minstrel life of endless pain Rearrange all my words so it doesn't hurt your Sentiments, breath mints, chocolate chips After eight, he takes me on a date I'm late as usual Procrastinating now My baby be waiting on the clock, tick tock Waiting on the clock, tick tock, tick tock He be waiting on the clock, tick tock Waiting on the clock, tick tock, tick tock Lip sync for your life, this is a battle Survival of the fittest, I'm the illest little Natsadi Coco, they think I'm all loco For sure they want more though We going in circles of versions to potions and lotions and creams And all the in-between screams Blocking our chemistry screams Will be the death of me the death of me, the death of me, the dead, 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 the death of me. But, oh, you've been on the phone for 11 days, talking to your boss, trying to get a raise. I'll be taking class, trying to find a way to get out of this mess, leave without a trace. You'll be trying to figure out all my ways. Stitch me like the lazy daisy, okay? Racing through my mind like a bullet train. Thoughts cause I'm insane, y'all. Thank you so much. Please do check it out. Thank you, thank you. I feel all your love and I'm gonna take it with me forward for my journey. So alright, yeah. Last two songs and then I'm done. Um, so the next one is yeah the first single of mine that I released on streaming platforms and etc. And uh, it's called Man Child. Again, clearly it's a diss track. <laughs> Nothing new there. Uh, I just need my key.
Okay, yeah, so this song is called Man Child. You can check it out. It's on YouTube. I will be uh, releasing it again with some few revisions to make it sound a little better. <laughs> but that was the first single that I released. It's on YouTube. You can check it out. Man Child, Nata Oku. You will find it. There's a lyric video. Okay, so yeah. So this song also, uh, it was kind of my friend sent me a poem that she wrote and then I just kind of made it into a song so I took her verse and then I wrote a verse and then whoosh, 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 collaboration happened so yeah then this is man child you can sing along uh, for, for, for the chorus you'll, you'll, it's pretty catchy okay you can clap along with the with the with the chicks with the chucks yeah Okay. And sing along. to hear you all. Okay, so heads up. I composed this song on the guitar. It's called Cavity. It's literally about a really bad cavity that I had in my mouth. But that made me kind of introspect as usual since I do that a lot. And then I was like, oh, we all have cavities within us. Then this song came out. So yeah, it's a very nostalgic song. It's um, it's about a void. Okay, cavity. Yeah, there's a literal and metaphorical meaning to it. So the metaphorical meaning is <laughs> that we all have a void within, right? 
<laughs> we're trying to fill this void with something or the other like whatever whatever comes along you know it can be doesn't have to be a negative thing it's just that we all because we have an emptiness within us we are actually able to do things because if we didn't have that feeling that oh i'm not i need to do something so this emptiness kind of leads us to do the things that we are either meant to do or maybe we realize oh i shouldn't do that that's not good for me so th- this is a song about that so yeah originally written and composed on the guitar this is a uk version first time i'm playing it tonight so i might make a few mistakes here and there okay yeah
All right, thank you so much for having me. Um, it was great. Please do check out my music. I'm Nata Uku again. N A T A U K U. Just gotta do this because <laughs> it's the uh, artist struggle. <laughs> All right. So. <laughs> thank you so much. You've been such an amazing audience. I have had the time of my life. So can't wait to hear the next. performers and all the best and thank you thank you once again <laughs> <laughs> thank you guys that was just so so beautiful yes. like that was really nice thank you thank you so much natasha for your music and it was really inspirational really really good thank you so much guys next up we have uh,